The rail industry, specifically in this country, is a hugely exciting industry at the moment. Some of our biggest infrastructure projects are rail. It's an exciting industry to be part of, with quite frankly fantastic short and long-term career prospects. I think attending conferences like the Next Generation Rail is really good because you learn a lot of innovations which you may be able to apply in your business. The career you're in, embarking upon is actually people skills will be not just important but even more important as time goes on. So the more technology we've got, actually the more people skills we will need. Well, the Next Generation Rail event is a really important uh, event for us uh, every year. Uh, the more experienced, all the experienced staff leave the uh, leave the industry. We need to be able to make sure that there's a, a good flow of people coming into the industry to meet all our needs. I think this is a great conference because it brings together young people from across the UK, research and the industry, and to attract young people to work in rail. I'm here with Heather from the University of Birmingham, who has won the competition for the best research. Congratulations. Thank you. What, what was your project about? Um, I'm looking at a method to improve the energy efficiency in railway networks. I think the key message that's come out of this conference is just to be innovative. I'm here with Joe from Network Rail and he's just won the best industry case study. Uh, it feels really good, you know, it's really, really good to display some of the great work that Network Rail is doing and it was you know, great to fight off some of the tough competition this year. This event and others are so important to let us all come together, let us meet people from across the industry, understand the industry a bit more. Also the, the networking side that is actually so, so important for us at the beginning of our careers. What you do affects day to day life and um, you basically keep the world going. As the event theme suggests, knowledge across borders, for example, not necessarily country borders, it could be the borders between companies, just share knowledge and, and make the most out of it. Well, I think the, the very first thing is uh, to, uh, to, to love what you do, be passionate about what you do, and then uh, and you will move on quickly.